time now for fun and excitement as Singapore celebrates 46 years of independence. The National Day Parade 2011, live from Marina Bay. It was just a tiny island when Sir Stanford Arafels arrived here, but he saw potential in establishing a trading post thanks to its natural deep harbor. So starts the story of Singapore. It is less than a hundred years, but here we are progressing from a village to a metropolis, and we are here at Marina Bay, just about a kilometer from where Sir Stanford Raffles first landed in 1819. This is Singapore 2011, and this is the National Day Parade 2011, celebrating 46 years of independence. The Marina Bay skyline beautifully capturing the vibrant spirit of Singapore, a changing landscape but with familiar attractions. And surrounding the bay are some 100,000 others who are also joining in the festivities with perhaps one of Singapore's most famous tourist attractions, the Mer Lion. And getting a vantage point as best as they can, celebrating the country's be biggest birthday bash from the Singapore Flyer. Green sector were born to do this. Huh? Green sector, not only will you stand up, not only will you see, I don't think yet. You will stand up and say, what you love. And Singapore's latest landmark, the Helix Bridge. The world's first curved bridge, and its structure resembles that of a DNA strand. A little peekaboo from the Helix Bridge, and this is where we're at. You see the Sea of Red? Yes, we're right here at the Marina Bay floating platform. From the world's tallest Ferris wheel to the world's first double Helix Bridge, and then the world's largest floating platform. These are the sites that have surrounded us, and these are symbols of the country's competence, confidence, and commitment to constantly seek new heights to scale. Good afternoon, and welcome to Medikov's coverage of this year's National Day Parade, coming to you live from the Marina Bay floating platform and a warm hello to our regional viewers watching us on Channel News Asia International. Singapore today celebrates 46 years of independence, transforming itself from a sleepy fishing village to the modern metropolis it is today through the hard work of its people. And the crowd are welcoming now our members of parliament led by Speaker of Parliament Mr. Abdullah Tamuji. MPs making their way into the Marina Bay floating platform to the flags being waved by the more than 30,000 people here greeting our members of parliament. And many of our members of parliament were recently involved in the thrilling general elections just a couple of months ago and we are honoured to have them with us today. Members of Parliament act as a bridge between the community and the government by ensuring that the concerns of their constituents are heard in Parliament. Bay floating platform and as the members of Parliament say hello to us we will say hello to you I'm Mark Richmond and I'm Glenda Chong your commentators for this evening's parade spectators here at the following platform have arrived as early as 4 p.m. in fact at around about 3 p.m. already there was a queue at the Esplanade and these people have braved the hot weather to arrive here at the Marina Bay floating platform now they're getting a nice little warm-up the weather has warmed them up as much as possible thank you very much but the show hosts are doing their warm-ups as well and we will be back in a very short while with more from the National Day Parade 2011. In the words of our National Day song this year, we are going to be back in a heartbeat. So high me is the red lion. As he's approaching, our promenade will say, ooh. And then when he lands, in a heartbeat. 
Welcome back to National Day 2011 celebrations. Coming to you live from the Marina Bay floating platform. And a big hello as well to our listeners on Media Corps Radio 938 Live. Wearing the colors of celebration, Singaporeans from all walks of life, young and old, celebrating the nation's 46th birthday. They all come from different races and different cultures, but they're all waving one flag, that of the Singapore flag. And you can see our hosts getting the crowd, cheering the crowd out to sing, along with the performers for the day. A shot of Bloco and then... A Cute little boys from the Nuts crew are dancing as well to the music of ABBA and Dancing Queen. Now, Glenda, I don't know if the organizers had a hand in choosing these songs for a specific reason, but Dancing Queen was released just seven days after Singapore turned 11 years old in 1976. Earlier on, we heard Hey Drew from the Beatles. That was released 17 days after Singapore turned three. All August songs released, and this song, Nobody by Wonder Girls, was completed in August in 2009, or 2008, I should say. So there we go. I think they probably had a hand in this as well. It's a very good job. Great choices. I'm enjoying the song. If you at home know the lyrics, why not sing along as well? Yes, it is a musical this year after all, isn't it? A musical extravaganza. And because of that, uh, the audience are encouraged to do a little bit of sing and dance. And yes, smile as well, which we've seen plenty of here at the Marina Bay floating platform. Those are the IT girls, the Nuts crew, along with the Touch Motivators on stage, providing the percussion drums behind is Bloco Singapura. And we're going to get into Justin Bieber's Baby, which uh, the younger generation will know all about, and they will probably teach the older generation to sing as well. It is what it is here at the Marina Bay floating platform with the flags all out. Singapore turns 46 years old. And the people in blue you saw earlier on there, they come from Touch Community Services. And they have been beside these guys and girls in the crowd, young and old. And as I said, united and waving one flag. That's a perfect shot, especially if you're traveling on the expressways today. It's just a sea of red here at the Marina Bay floating platforms. And right in front of the touch motivators, you can see the fun packs, Glenda. These fun packs, they come in four designs depicting the unique aspect of Singapore. And what's interesting about this year's goodie bag is that it comes with an eco message where audiences, they're encouraged to reuse and recycle the items. So, for example, the flags that you see are her members of parliament waving. Now, the stand can be used as a card holder. The popular light sticks will be lit when the sun goes down and it can double up at home as a lamp. Mm -hmm. And we have the ever popular maracas as well. Well, dare we say it, the audience have gone gaga over receiving the fun packs. And they love the items inside there. We all know this song. One of the songs that is almost a staple diet in the new millennium when it comes to the National Day Parade. This is home. And a very apt theme this year is Marjulan, Singapore spirit. So what does it mean? Marjulan means onward. It represents our strength, energy and dynamism to continually strive towards building a better Singapore. And a word we are familiar with, which has deep roots in our history, one that also connects with our national anthem. Wait for me Wait where that uh, river uh, uh, always flows. Here we go. Your wrong was there, I can't compare, so this is where I This is home. This is Singapore. 
and 46 years on we can be proud of what we have achieved as a nation the marina bay skyline in its full completion for the first national day parade now show hosts for